okay dear all dr vishal here uh, from vishwa medical coaching and uh, i was thinking about which is the best suitable finger because in these days we are doing so many pulse oximetry findings so which finger will be the most suitable for uh, taking the pulse oximetry most of you will believe that there may not be any difference logically there may, should not be any difference between any of the fingers but uh, most of the time we always choose the index finger as you see many times we choose on the index finger but what about middle finger ring finger or maybe little finger are they different now remember experts also believe that uh, index finger receives most of its blood supply from the radial artery now little finger receives most of the blood supply from the ulnar artery or there may be little differences between radial and ulnar arteries it it, it is a possibility but it is a middle finger that receives equal blood supply from both the arteries so it is logical that the middle finger will show exact uh, pulse oximetry finding that may be highest pulse oximetry finding it may be a difference of maybe uh, just 2 or 3 percent but in these days in the uh, patient is an hypoxic uh, it is the best finding can be seen only in the middle finger we may go for any of the fingers i am not saying we may we should choose only middle finger but it is a middle finger that receives equal blood supply and highest blood supply from both radial as well as ulnar arteries so usually logically we should choose the middle finger if the patient is hypoxic to know the highest possible finding for this particular patient thank you very much